What's up, Forrest? I'm Jaden. Uh, hey, here uh, with all change, your... change of plans. You're doing like media or something. I'm anchoring. We're not. Why? I already, not, I already wrote my script. No, we're not. I'm. I'm anchoring. No, you're, but like no, I don't think you understand. No, I wrote. You're going. I just. I, I, Good morning, Forrest. I'm Liam Bishop. Today's date is Thursday, April 8th, 2022, and on today's show, we will be updating you on all your news and sports. If you pay to close attention to the walls here at school, you notice that there is a bunch of posters for kids you may or may have not seen. These posters are for class officer elections that are coming up. So here are the videos that we have to watch for every year. What's up class of 25? My name is Anna Bernard and I'm running for your sophomore class historian. As an FHS varsity and competitive cheerleader, I know how to efficiently work as a team to accomplish tasks and goals. I believe I'm the best suited candidate for this position because of my work ethic, honesty, and critical thinking skills. That being said, I know I can not only be an asset for SGA, but the sophomore class. Being historian, I will keep account for the past school year and make our next school year better than the year before. I stay active in school events and will be a voice for the sophomore class so our ideas and thoughts can be included in planning events. We, the class of 2025, are a powerhouse of innovation and creativity. And with your vote, I want to aid that to make our sophomore year one for the books. So vote Anna Bernard for your sophomore class historian. What's up, Forrest? My name is Colin Scroggie, and I'm running for your junior class president. You might be wondering if I'm the right man for the job, but I'm here to tell you I am. I played varsity soccer here at Forrest for two years and hope to make it four. This will be my second year in SGA, and I have recently won district vice president. Within SGA, I've helped our former president, Camden Collins, plan Wacky Wildcat games and set up and take down all events. I'm involved in HOSA and other extracurricular activities. I can guarantee you that if you put your vote and trust in me, our class will be the best in the school. I am here as a representative, but I am your voice. Let me be your vote, the right choice. Vote Colin Scroggie for junior class president. Hey Forrest, my name is Aiden Curtis and I'm running for your 2025 class president for the upcoming school year. As president, I believe that I can bring various aspects to the table, such as leadership, hard work, determination, and more. But being president does not mean I make all the important decisions when it comes down to it. It's about working with each and every one of you to make the next year best for you and your classmates. In school, I'm involved in many extracurricular activities, such as being on multiple clubs, which include French club and Gov club, and more. Playing sports and being your current class treasurer. And being your treasurer has taught me the leadership skills necessary to be highly successful as your class president. One final thing, where do you find a cow with no legs? Right where you left it. Anyways, I hope you vote Curtis for president on April 12th. Hey Wildcats, I'm Hudson Chrysler and I'm running for your class of 2025 historian. I have absolutely loved our first year here at Forest and cannot wait to see what the next three years hold. I am the best candidate for this position because I work well on a team, am well experienced, and I am dedicated to seeing my goals turn into reality. As a historian, I, Hudson Chrysler, would work hard to document and capture all of our amazing high school moments and memories for the benefit of our class. Let's build a better history by voting Hudson Chrysler for your class of 2025 historian. Hello, as most of you know, my name is Jaden Taylor and I am running for treasurer. I plan to make our years throughout high school fun and exciting. As treasurer, I will be the one who arranges and organizes our fundraisers. Along with the other class officers, we shall work together as a team and try our absolute best to give you, the class of 2024, the best possible experience we can. As a member of the National Honor Society, I feel I possess the required skills to take on this task. Every day, I am faced with new obstacles and challenges that I can overcome. I feel as a student and as a person in general, I have always been one to stand out. I like, I like to come up with new ideas, solve problems, and I look forward to working with the officers, students, and getting involved with the activities that Class of 2024 will participate in. Hello everyone, my name is Kaylin Howard and I'm running for your junior class vice president. 
Throughout the past two years of high school, I have been involved in NHS, Dance Marathon, and HOSA. I am enrolled in all high honors and advanced placement courses while maintaining a steady 4.4 GPA. Outside of my academics, I am a two-year varsity volleyball player for Forest and have played travel volleyball for Ocala Power since I was 10 years old. Throughout my years of playing volleyball, I have received numerous awards, such as the Power Award, given to the player who exemplifies leadership and who puts their teammates before themselves. I envision myself as a great fit for this position because I strive to achieve the maximum by challenging myself in school and in my everyday life. Once voted into this position, I will assist my fellow president in elevating the school morale and keeping tradition here at Forest High School. Make sure to vote Kaylin Howard as your 2022-2023 junior class vice president. Go Cats! What's up, Wildcats? My name is Mia Dolan, and I'm running to be your class of 2025 parliamentarian. In school and in life, I always work hard to achieve my goals. I will always put forth 110% effort to make sure that your goals as a class can be met. Outside of school, my experience both volunteering and in sports has not only taught me how to help others, but also how to make real life decisions. I love supporting Forest in our school activities, and as your parliamentarian, I will try my hardest to keep our school events as organized and enjoyable as possible. Our future depends on our ability to cooperate and work together to make our school the greatest it's ever been, and I feel that as a group, we can accomplish that. I hope I can earn your vote so that I can help you have the best sophomore year it can be, and once again, my name is Mia Dolan, and I'm running to be your sophomore class parliamentarian. Hello, Forest Wildcats. I'm Peyton Fox, and I'm running for your 2024 class parliamentarian. Here at Forest, I participate in many clubs, including HOSA and NHS, as well as being a member of the varsity sideline and competitive cheer teams. Outside of school, I'm involved in Little Women of Ocala. I enjoy traveling, spending time with my family, and competing as an all-star cheerleader, where I'm a silver world medalist. If you vote for me, I promise to be your voice and represent you. Don't forget, vote for Pete April 12th through the 13th. Remember, vote Peyton Fox, class parliamentarian. Hi, my name is Tatiana Soto, and I am currently the class secretary of the sophomore class. As our high school years are slowly coming to an end, I want to continue to represent the 2024 class and continue to have a successful, fun, and memorable last two years. I have been in SGA for two years now, so I am very experienced as to what goes on. This past year, I was the team manager of the girls and the boys soccer team, as well as currently the boys volleyball manager. I am in HOSA Environmental and Atlas Club, so I love to stay involved. As being the current secretary and being in SGA, I have heard your problems and concerns with events, school, and teachers. I will take that into consideration as your VP and let your voices be heard. I am very outgoing, always laughing, and always here to talk to. Again, remember to vote Tati for VP for our 2022-23 school year. It's great to see all of our class officers running. For current sophomores and juniors, CAT crew applications are due next Friday, April 15th. Today is grad bash after school, so don't forget. Juniors, remember, Wednesday next week, you'll be taking the SAT. If you're not interested in taking the free SAT, then talk to your guidance counselor so you can opt out. There are library club meetings Monday, April 11th after school. Any members that are going to the Fantastic Beats, The Secrets of Dumbledore movie, be sure to get your parents' permission form in. With spring sports in full swing, let's throw over to someone amazing with our sports updates. Wow, thanks, Liam. Uh, no, no, no. I, I was talking about me. You're not doing sports either. You, you're gone. You're editing but something. I, but you, they literally told me to no, do sports. No, you're not doing we sports. We can't have the same person on Wait, main yeah, but, sports. But we are. But, but we are. They, there's the exit. There. What is, there you go. There you go. I, I don't, hey, like, can, can you do that? <laughs> hey, Boris, I'm here with all your sports today. Our girls beach volleyball team won against Lake Weir and North Marion 5-0 last night and remained undefeated. Our Wildcat girls tennis won against North Marion last night as well 7-0 with a final season record of 14-2. If you're interested in sideline cheer next year, please plan to attend the interest meeting on Thursday, April 21st at 5.30 in the FHS cafeteria. Contact Coach Bigelow or Coach Peak for more information. If you plan on playing football next year, tryouts will be held on April 13th and 14th 
14th after school in the field house. All student athletes who are interested in playing football next fall must attend tryouts. Student athletes interested in trying out should have a physical on the file, as well as a minimum of a 2.0 GPA. Please see Mrs. Sherhouse in the athletics office for participation paperwork. All participants should bring in athletic shoes, cleats, and a bottle of water. Tryouts will be from 3.30 to 6 p.m. That wraps up all the sports news I have for you today. Now let's take a look at the weather with Liam. Hey Forrest, it's Liam with all your weather for today. It's annoyingly sunny and windy. Now back to the anchors. Thanks Liam. That's all the news I have for you today. To stay updated on all things Forrest, follow us at FHS underscore WCAT on TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram. And make sure to stay subscribed to our YouTube channel. Once again, I'm Liam. Have a great day, Forrest. And like always, go Cats!